you know, I've probably got, I've got good memories because of, uh, of the way I played as an amateur next door. Uh, you know, I won there. I remember it was bad conditions. Um, you know, and the two courses are pretty similar. So, uh, um, you know, it's what, eight years later, I think I'm a bit more mature and, uh, you know, understand the game a bit better. So, uh, um, you know, I'm really, I'm, I'm looking forward to this, to this Open. Um, you know, it, it'd, be, it'd be nice to, have, to get that clatter joke. You know, I've, I've had three weeks off in, down in South Africa. I decided not to play the Scottish Open because I guessed that the weather was going to be bad. That was my prediction. And uh, I think I, th I wasn't far off. But uh, you know, I decided to stay home in, in, in South Africa. It, it's pretty cold right now, um, but we get, you know, we get clear days uh, and with a bit of wind. So I figured it would be actually pretty good practice, which it was. Um, the courses are dry, it's running. So I could I could really uh, prepare for the way that these courses would play, very very close. And uh, so uh, you know we'll see how that works out. I feel I feel good. I did did a lot of uh, a lot of practicing, and uh, um, played yesterday, and it actually felt pretty good. I mean in a way I've always liked playing as the underdog and then surprise people. But uh, um, you know that is what it is. Uh, I'm I'm out there to give it my best and see if I can win this golf tournament. Whether my odds are 200 to 1 or 12 to 1, it doesn't doesn't make no difference to me. I've been to a few golf courses where uh, I've given, given sort of speeches, a bit of a talk, and, you know, there's lots of lots of youngsters out there that all of a sudden have got a really big interest. Um, you know, so I'm, I'm sure it's had a made a, I'm sure it's made a big, uh, a big difference to South African golf. Well, it does seem like it's getting a little bit, um, you know, the ages seem to be dropping a little bit. But, uh, um, you know, yeah, uh, Tiger Woods was young when he was, very, was that same age when he was starting to win. Um, and he kept on winning until, until all his injuries came up now. So, uh, um, you know, I, I, I would say, I think... People used to say the your peak your peak was always between 30 and 33 or something like that. Um, maybe it's moved by a year or two, maybe to 28. But I think the lifespan will be a bit longer now. Is I think the the guys, the youngsters, are uh, are exercising more than what the previous generation used to do. So might maybe our span is a bit longer.